6.37, um, the doctor told me I was going to spend the rest of my life in a wheelchair. But it started before that, I think probably when I was about 17 or 18, because I fell down a flight of stairs. Maybe that's what started it, I don't know. But as I got older, when I, when I had my children in my 20s, I had very bad pregnancies, and I was sick all the time. So I was always bending over to be sick, and um, so I was always in pain. And then after my children were born, my doctor, Mr. Clever, said, don't pick your children up because it hurts your back. He said, just get down and hug the child, and that way you'll feel better. Or he gave me tranquilizers, things like that. Anyway, I changed doctors and I had a back surgery when I was 37 because my disc had erupted. A year later, I had another back surgery because the, the next disc up was gone. Um, it bought me a few good years, but the last few years, I've been on pain pills almost steadily. I live on Excedrin, and for the last while, I've been going to a pain clinic in Canada. He does something called IMS, which is intermuscular stimulation. He puts great big needles in. It's painful. It hurts. I hear people ahead of me and behind me screaming. But it does help. I believe it helps, but it takes a long time and it's expensive. And my lovely Canadian government does not cover it. So it's been a rough couple of months, a rough couple of years. I met Brooke on Monday. She put some strips on me. We were at a senior expo. I was on a walker, and I walked all the way around a couple of times, two, three times. I never fell once. Um, after I left, well, I came back and I talked to Brooke. She put a couple more strips on me, and I signed up to the company. I was that excited about it. But then I went, I got into my car, and I drove over to Wakota Hatchie, which is a boardwalk where you walk for about two miles and you view the wildlife. And for the first time in years, I walked all the way around without stopping once and without sitting once. Wow. Saw the alligators, leaned on the thing and watched the alligators. I was so excited. So I hope this stuff is going to help. It's very new for me. I'm, I'm listening to all of you. I'm excited. I'm scared. I guess like you, is it really going to work? Is it going to help? Is it going to fix my problems? But I've got so many friends and relatives that are in constant pain. I hope that if I can get them going hmm. and maybe we can do something. And where do you live? I live in Canada, just outside of Toronto. I'm here. And in the States, I'm here for six months uh, in Century Village otherwise known as Cemetery Village. <laughs> it's a senior's place, and I'm one of the babies in there. <laughs> and everybody's on a walker, or not everybody, but a lot of people. And I belong to a club with several hundred members, and I'm going to try and get Brooke to come in and talk to them and just see what happens. Thank you, Granny.